A Washington County man and his girlfriend have been charged in connection with the shooting deaths of his uncle and grandmother after their bodies were found Wednesday in a home near Sharpsburg. Darren Warner, 24, and Destiny Euler, 20, are charged with two counts each of first and second degree murder and multiple other crimes in the slayings of Evelyn Rowland and her son, Jack Rowland. The Washington County Sheriff's Office wrote in court documents that the Rollins' bodies were found by a family friend in their home at 17342 Shepherdstown Pike. Deputies said they were called to the home at 1.18 p.m. for an unattended death investigations. When officers arrived, they were met by Eveline Rollins' daughter, Sharon Rowland who said her mother and brother lived in the farmhouse where their bodies were found. Sharon Rowland told authorities that a family friend noticed the Rowland's truck was gone and the cattle had not been fed when he showed up to pick up bales of hay. She said they also noticed the back door was unlocked and the window shades were drawn. Roland told deputies that she knew something wasn't right and asked the family friend to go through the house. She said the friend found the bodies of her mother and brother inside. Deputies said they checked the house and found Jack Roland on the dining room floor and Evelyn Roland on a bed in the living room. Both of the bodies had gunshot wounds to the head, according to court documents. Sharon Rowland told investigators that she believed Warner might be responsible because he was Evelyn Rowland's grandson and had a history of stealing tools and other items from the farm. Authorities then drove to Warner's home at 12110 Crystal Falls Drive near Smithsburg, where he lived with Euler. Court documents show Smithsburg Police Chief George Knight noticed the Rollins' stolen GMC pickup in the driveway of the home. Euler and Warner were seen in the truck before Knight observed them walk inside the residence. The sheriff's office then formed a perimeter around the home and the Washington County Special Response Team was called to the scene. Deputies said Euler and Warner were arrested and identified by night as the people he saw in the stolen truck. An investigation determined the Rollins were shot at close range with what appeared to be a shotgun. Family members said that in addition to the truck, a $300 shotgun was missing from the home, and Eveline Rollins' purse and wallet were gone. The combined value was estimated at $75. Deputies said Doyler and Warner also stopped at his other grandmother's house on Wednesday, but they quickly left when she asked how the two were getting around because he didn't own a vehicle. A search of the home on Crystal Falls Drive produced the keys to the stolen truck and clothing that appeared to be stained with blood, the documents said. Euler and Warner are being held without bond at the Washington County Detention Center. Investigators said they're asking anyone who purchased tools, equipment or coins from Euler or Warner may call the sheriff's office at 240-313-2185.